What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today we have a brand new product review. This is 2021 Panini Prism Basketball. Yes, Prism again. Uh, this is the Team All format. Now, we've done like at least 10 Prism formats, probably more, and there's still a few more to come. So uh, there's definitely a lot of Prism. And these Team All ones are kind of like a mix between a retail and like a hobby one. They're sold exclusively in Asia via the Team All platform. So we're gonna go uh, review this one today. And as always, if you guys like these videos, drop a like, sub, share, comment. We can definitely do some more, and there's always tons more coming uh, like this and not like this, doing some other stuff uh, around cards, sports, stuff like that. Now, we actually have a giveaway going on, and if you want to learn more about it, uh, check out the description and the pinned comment. All you got to do is like the video, subscribe, and then go to the pinned comment description, and there's a video you have to comment on. You can probably enter in less than a minute. We're giving away a rookie card of a superstar of your choice from a um, select pool, so definitely check that out if you're interested. And uh, yeah, so prism time. Here's the information on this product here. So now SRP, I'm not exactly sure how much it is, um, but resale, I guess is what matters now, would be 375, give or take 10 to 20 bucks, something something in that range. So these are sold once again on the team up platform in Asia, and they always make their way to the US like the choice products, anything else, uh, international exclusive, the blasters of Court Kings. And there's five cards per pack, 12 uh, packs per box. These come in 12 box cases. A lot of team models come in 20. But these, I think the optics and the select come in uh, come in 12. Some of the kind of like hybrid ones came in 20, I think. I think. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they're all 12. I don't know. It's been a, I never really actually bought a case. I've seen them, but it's been a while. Um, but base silvers are in here, as well as the exclusive blue and gold waves. The gold being the rare ones. The blue are, should be decently common. Uh, not numbered. And those are the only parallels in this product. And then for the autographs, rookie penmanship prisms, there's also the blue and the gold wave for that. And that's it. So this is one of the smallest ones we've seen in a, in a long time. Just one little line there of stuff you can find. 300 card set, 50 rookies. And um, yeah, that's uh, for, for the most part, that's it. Um, yeah, so let's see what we have here in this box. Pac-Man cards at the IG. That's where I kind of post uh, early looks at new products, exclusive info. Uh, that's where I buy. That's where I sell. I bought these on Instagram. So yeah, definitely drop a follow if you haven't. We got Jason Kidd and Garland in the back. All those cards, and they look pretty cool. So, uh, anyone has any cool Garland stuff? KPJ too. Maybe you know, like a numbered hobby prism rookie. That'd be that'd be awesome. Maybe uh, if you're trying to move it, I might be interested. So feel free to hit me up. Definitely try to get like a nice prism, maybe like a select court side, something like that. And Jason Kidd, that dude saves me in 2K. He, he's just he's too good. Fits my system perfectly. But let's see what's going on in here. Here's our packs kind of just sitting there. So there you go. And put this like this, pull this forward. And there we go. All right, move this like that. And let's see what we have. So once again, those parallels are really the only thing. And maybe if you're really lucky autographs, those are really the only things you're, uh, you're looking for. Team all is very parallel heavy, not hit heavy at all. Autographs should be pretty rare. I wouldn't expect many autographs. Maybe like one, two, maybe three. Like, but I wouldn't expect too many per case. But so are pretty rare. Hopefully the base rookies aren't too uh, scarce either. Definitely would add some value to have rookies coming up pretty frequently. So first one, John Collins. And here's the look at these cards. And there's nice Kyra. So the blue wave, um, you know, same backs. They'll say prism. Those are the parallels. And blue wave, so nice. Put that there. Actually, we'll put it here for now. All right, and there we go. There's a rookie Kyra. Once again, as always, I've been trying to do a lot more different formats. So doing team all here, I skipped some of the team alls in the past, but from here on out, I'm trying to do just as many as I can. So if there's something you like to see, it's always show the support in these videos, like uh, subbing, share, comment. If it's something you like, and we can try to do as many as we can. Uh, the blue wave is the fourth card this time. Not, not not too often you see that, unless it's a rookie. Oh, maybe actually. Oh no! All right, well, <laughs> all right. Sorry guys. And R.J. Hampton. I don't know. I, I thought I was onto something. I, I was not. Okay, so next one up. And then in the comments, let me know what do you prefer. I mean, retail would probably be less than this one here. And then hobby would obviously cost much more. This is kind of in the middle. So what do you prefer if you're going to open Prism? What were you going to, or what would you uh, rather have? And looks like we're getting about one per pack, which is to be expected, one parallel 
her and no rookie that time. Ouch. And I would say maybe one to three golds if it's anything like uh, Mosaic. Mosaic, t -Mall. I think it's the same format. And you should, oh, what's going on here? Two backwards cards. All right. Uh, I don't want to get my hopes up. The hopes are up. Here we go. Did we get no way. We got two autos in one pack. What? Blue wave. I've never seen this before. This must be some sort of error, unless they messed up throughout the product. Sometimes you see errors, and they're product-wide errors, like accidentally two autos, two autos in one pack. We got a Robert Woodard, which is which is okay, but this one is pretty nice. Killian Hayes. Wow. Mere seconds ago, I was saying, man, you're never going to see those autos ever. All right, let's see what this is. Russell Westbrook. Got a Tillman with a little... So that might be... Actually, no, I think it's Scratch. I don't know. We can try removing it later. Uh, Pritchard. If I remove, I just have to like, wipe it with a cloth. It comes off. It comes off. It doesn't. It doesn't. Wow. So that's that's a good pack. I'll take that all day. Killian Hayes. Nice. Get a top loader for him. Wow. I, I, I was literally like... Yeah, those are... That's obviously not two autos. One backwards card. I probably would have expected an auto. Two. Didn't get my hopes up. Just showed the card and... Wait. It is an auto. So that... that Ranks up there as one of the craziest packs I've ever seen. I mean, let me know down below. What do you guys think? Is Have you ever seen anything like that before? Huh. Wow, wow, wow. Now, we opened Status, which is a team all. That's a 20-box case. And there's like two autos in the whole case. And they're both in the same box. So that was pretty crazy. This was the same pack. Must be dreaming. Hmm. All right, let's keep going. If they want to just, you know, throw in another two autos... I'm not gonna say no. Wow, that was that was great. That was truly excellent. Thank you, uh, Panini. If that was an error, thank you, error. If it was meant to be like that. That's that's awesome. Rodney Hood. There we go. All right. I actually prefer the twelve box case ones. Kind of makes it you know that case it'll be in less boxes. And here we have a silver and. Therefore, no wave, but there's a jaw. Your two. These rookie parallels aren't popping out at all. Alfred Payton, far from a rookie. Hmm. We, we got our two autos, though. As far as this box is concerned, I'm really not expecting too much like more. We, we definitely got our, our fair share of, of nice stuff already from this, this first box. And we're opening two to kind of give a better representation of what this product would offer. The end, I can kind of give my final thoughts and rating review. What I think of it overall. Man, these rookies. Scarce. Fake Pascal. Imposter one. Saban Lee. And there we go. So, obviously it's Kevon Looney. Kevon Looney's picture, just like this, is on the Pascal and the uh, the Kevon Looney card. So, that's a, that's a product-wide error, not just a one-card error. Alright, next one up. And another thing, I, I feel like I've asked a thousand questions already, but I truly am curious. What's your favorite prison format for the price? You know, is there one that you think is, you know, that's the one? Or, you know, just whatever you can get your hands on. I'll take that. I always forget to look for this one. LeBron, James. There we go. And not rookie, Jared Allen. Centering isn't the best, but I'm just happy to pull one. We, we were on a dry spell of pulling these. And then, similar to this break... It was craziness, and we uh, got our first, not one, but two of these. I think it was the Mega Boxes we opened not too long ago. And there we go. Van Vliet. Another sleeve. I'll absolutely take that. Yeah, so there's so many formats, and then, once again, there's still some we're waiting on. It's crazy how many prison formats there are. I feel like every year they add one, two more. Hobby. Uh, Gravity Heat, which hasn't come yet. There's two Megas. Fanatics. Fast Break. Retail Box. Blaster Box. Cello Packs. It never ends, but definitely a... If you're trying to put together the rainbow rainbow, good luck. Tony Snell, man. This thing is hot, hot, hot. And more there. Cool. We have a few packs probably left in this one. Yeah, like three packs left. I don't know if we're going to... If we get those two autos, I don't know if we're going to get a gold. Usually, I feel like you get a gold per. Now, obviously, not one in six chance at it being a rookie. 
I feel like usually you get like a rookie parallel. Oh, oh, oh here we go. Red. Obdia? I don't, I mean, there you go. I don't know how I guessed that one, but. Oh, I saw the red, I guess. There's only like several players who could be red, but I'll take an Obdia all day. And there's a nice Malachi Flynn. So there's our uh, rookie. I, I feel like from opening a decent amount of team all, what I would say is you usually get at least a rookie parallel. Uh, I, you usually will not get an autograph. We got very lucky this time. So if you get one, I can't stress enough. Unless it was a product wide error, and maybe we'll find out with that next box. Don't expect autographs. They don't come too uh, too common. And then maybe you get a gold or two per. We haven't got one yet. That's at least mosaic. And maybe optic and select too. Now prism could be different. Uh, the print run for those golds is not to ten like the like the true golds. It's definitely shorter printed, but it's it's not like to ten. It'd be nice to number them. I, I kind of wish they did number them. I don't like non-numbered, kind of indefinite, who knows, print runs. All right, and uh, silver. So no gold in this one. We'll see if it comes in the next one. All right, let's see what we have here. But really good box. I'll absolutely take that. Colin Sexton, could he be on the move? And there's a nice Akongwu there. We'll see what happens with uh, Colin Sexton there. Very interesting to see what team he lands with if he, if he gets moved. So we'll put our cards like this. Uh, first box, absolute success. If I can get another one like that, I mean, this is truly, truly a great day. All right, empty box. And we have one more. It's going to be tough to beat that, but you never know. All right, let's see. What does Prism have for us? It's very odd opening. If you've seen our other, some of our other, other Prism ones, and it's been a little bit better since... Actually, yeah, it's definitely been better since, but we started very, very poorly with Prism. We we couldn't do well if our life depended on it. I couldn't, you know, buy a bucket, you know, kind of put in basketball terms. But, um, yeah, same thing with the last one, so let's see what we have. Now, if you're trying to get one for yourself, the places to get them would probably be kind of like eBay, online sellers, retailers will have them. Maybe some hobby shops, some of them do get them too, so I would just kind of, you know, check around, search, see if we can get it for a good price. For the best price, and uh, if you want to get one, there you go. I really want to see a gold wave. If we see a gold wave, preferably a rookie, obviously, easier said than done. That would be really nice. No rookies. JJ Reddick. All right. Next one up. Please gold. I really want to see two backwards cards again. After I saw that, I mean, that, that's just awesome. Got Nick Buckets. Cole Anthony. That's not bad. I'll take that. And Jonathan Isaac. All right. Maybe gold. Maybe not. Yeah, that's just a reflection. I thought we had another backwards card for a second. It's just the, I think the blue card reflecting on the card behind it. Not a rook. Horkma. So our, our blue waves haven't started. Oh, oh no. Yeah, no. When you see that, that rookie kind of background, you know, it's not, it's not a uh, Lomelo, but maybe we can get them here. Maybe we can squeeze that Lomelo somewhere in here. We're probably going to get a million other Hornets rookies from this one. Not named Lomelo. Nope. Hmm. All right. Uh, I don't know. Naismith? Yeah, Naismith. There you go. 50 50. All right. Please, gold. Now, maybe they made. One kind of suspicion I have is that they made a lot of this. Therefore, the golds have to be dispersed maybe a little more throughout. I don't know. But. Because I know if you open a mosaic, you usually get at least a few few golds i mean a gold or two and sometimes up to a few golds so i'm trying to say like i think we got three to four maybe sometimes not often but sometimes you usually get at least one you know, two here we didn't get one in that first one oh that box is kind of odd in a good way and i guess this one will be the i guess the second sample to see how it is kd rookie 
KJ Martin, I'll take that. I'll absolutely take that. KJ Martin, nice and not a rookie, but cool. Rockets. There we go. Maybe they move up. Got some nice guys there. All right. Oh, that was a save. That was a good save. He almost just took out KJ. I'll take that save. And no double autos yet. Totally expecting. Imagine triple autos. Imagine five autos, one pack. There we go. But no one ever saw it, so did it ever actually happen? That'd be crazy. You open a pack and... Oh, they're all backwards. Oh, no. Auto. 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 Now, Lamelo should be a redemption. And he's been a redemption all year. He's... He's going to be signing like 50,000, like 100,000 stickers, I don't know, or, and cards. He hasn't signed all year. Cody Ziller. Our guy, Cody. And there's Killian Hayes. Nice. Yeah, so unfortunately, he hasn't signed a single card since the early draft product, which product, which is kind of unfortunate because I don't know. I hope he doesn't abbreviate his signature either. It's kind of a messy signing of his name, but it's better than having like LB, which I kind of fear he could do. Oh, there's a gold wave. All right. So yeah, maybe you do get one per, or at least one per. Not guaranteed, but I'm kind of just usually. All right. How did I know? Wendell Carter Jr. Well, I did, I did say I was hoping we'd get a gold wave just to show you guys what it looks like. Wasn't expecting a big name at all, but Wendell Carter. There you go. So those are the gold waves. Now, there is also the uh, the hobby gold. There's the shimmer. Those are numbered. This is not numbered. And it's a print run I don't believe is to 10 like the other ones. But still nice. It's short printed. Definitely short printed. Uh, super short printed, especially compared to the blues. And you only get maybe one per uh, per box. Silver here. Or maybe maybe more if you like. Oh, 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 that's green. Naismith. I'll take a Naismith silver. And quickly. Cool. I thought that was uh, the kind of like Hornets colors for a second. Got real excited. And we have two packs left. Let's see what we have. Another blue. Okay. Oh, another one. Pokashevsky. Hmm. Mm hmm. Stewart. Wow. So this this is a solid box too. Put that there, and we'll see up Poku. Nice, nice, nice. Awesome. Give him a top loader. I mean, honestly, these boxes have been very. Very nice. I mean, I, I didn't know what to expect, honestly, but I'm liking what I'm seeing here. Overall, some uh, very good pulls. It's been it's been very nice. I'll put these here in the last pack. And also, for that giveaway that's going on, um, if you if you haven't didn't see where we talked about it earlier in the video, uh, go to the description and pin comment. Real easy to enter. Uh, the comment needs to be on the video link there. On the it was um, the rookie chase where we chased every All NBA player. We chased rookies of Curry, Luca. Uh, Kawhi, Giannis, and Jokic from their rookie boxes. That's the one you gotta comment on, so if you're interested, there you go. DJ Augustine. Uh, Vassell? Oh, Najee. Alright, that was Navy. And there we go. Lonzo. Where does he end up? Should be it. There we go. Empty box. That was a lot of fun. Real nice stuff, so let's do a recap now. And as always, if you guys like these uh, like these videos, you like to see us open all these products, want to see more, Definitely show the support in these vids. Thank you guys so much for all the support you've been showing. It's truly awesome, and uh, we'll have many more like this one. So like, comment, share, sub, and we'll have some more. But So here was the uh, the second box. And the second box, I'm going to put this here for now because I'll show it uh, after. But second box was, was solid, but the first box was crazy. Anyway, so uh, Naismith Silver got Stewart quickly. Got a Gold Wave, Wendell Carter Jr., and there's a KJ Martin. Should top load of that too. And um, then, yeah, a bunch of blues. Yeah, blue per pack. And there we go. We'll put this put this here. So you get a blue per pack. And I feel like, on average, you know, maybe get a like gold. If not one per box, maybe like almost one per box, you know. And then pull these up. And then you can get autographs, probably maybe a couple per case. So I just pull these first. 
Sexton, Kongwu, um, Hawkeye Flynn, Nora, and yeah, so tons of parallels. Nice stuff. I like I like this one. I, I was pretty pretty impressed with what I saw. And then we have a uh, Avdia. That's a nice one for sure. LeBron got Killian Hayes autograph and Woodard autograph. Two autos from one of the craziest packs that I've ever opened. Like just a single pack like that. That's one of the craziest packs I've ever opened just ever. That was insane. I mean, <laughs> I really thank you. Thank you, uh, Panini. That was awesome. But a lot of fun. I really enjoyed opening these. Final thoughts and rating review of the product. So I think it's a good product, honestly. Compared to some of the other Prism formats, it's not as expensive. Now there's no number parallels or hobby parallels like a hobby box, but for about, what was it? I think 375 ish. And that might go down if more hits to market. Not too sure though. Don't quote me on that. But uh, overall, it's nice stuff. If I had to rate on scale from one to 10, uh, all things considered. Now the ceiling isn't insanely high, but it's okay. And the floor is pretty, pretty decent. So I'd say it's about, um, I'd say it's a seven, I'd say seven out of 10, which, which is not bad at all. And I like it. So let me know what you guys think of this product down below. Is it hot? Is it not? What do you like? What do you not like? And if you get some, let me know what you get. Wish you guys the best of luck. But yeah, awesome stuff. So um, that's it for this one. I, I like this uh this format. Now, we got two autos. Don't expect two autos. I would definitely not uh, expect. I went into this not expecting these autos at all. I didn't expect one, let alone two. But yeah, really uh, fun to open these boxes. So we do have a few more things coming um, for Prism that haven't dropped yet which I do expect to drop at some point. Don't know when it's been forever, but I would expect that they still release uh, some more formats this year. So stay tuned. Not too many left, but there are still some left. So that does it, guys. Uh, once again, giveaway on the channel. Pin comment in the description of this video is where you can see more information about them. Our video that we posted maybe two videos ago, our you know big rookie chase where we chase all the top uh, rookie cards of NBA players, the NBA first team. That's the giveaway video. So like this video, subscribe, and then go to that video. And there's a, just you have to leave a comment on there. And the kind of what to leave in that comment is in the description. So very fun stuff. Really enjoyed opening these and stay tuned for tons of more uh, uh, boxes coming soon. I think some more releases come out not too far from now. So stay tuned for those and a lot of great stuff coming. So those guys, thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.